Hi guys, it's Yamada. Thank you so much for tuning in to Enjoyable Inspiration. Um, today I'm going to show you a Day of the Dead makeup tutorial. I really hope you like it. I put a lot of work into it. And I love you guys. I'm starting out with a clean and moisturized face. And I'm just going to add some primer to make sure the makeup stays. Trace the hollows of your eyes with an eyeliner. These do not have to be perfect, they're just an outline, so if you do mess up, don't freak out, it's okay. Use a tacky substance, like a glue stick, to smooth your eyebrows down so they can easily be painted over. Fill in your outline with the light blue color as a base. For easy application, wet your brush prior to applying face paint. Cover the lid of your eyes with black face paint all the way up to your brow bone. Set this with the black eyeshadow to take away some of the shine. Blend the edges of the outline together. Apply your white face paint with quick short strokes all over your face and around your eyes use long precise strokes for that clean look. Try not to have so many layers because we don't want to kick up your face. Add a scalloped border to your design with the color of your choice. I'm using e.l.f. liquid eyeliner to outline my border. For the forehead, I'm just now going to draw on a spider web. I'm using e.l.f. liquid eyeliner to line the web to give it a shadow effect. Now paint the rest of your face to include your lips. I'm touching up my blue face paint with some blue eyeshadow just to take away some more of the shine. Now I'm just setting my face paint with white powder. Now to create the appearance of a skeleton nose, I'm kind of just making the shape of a teardrop but with two points.
Fill that in with black eyeliner. To create some depth, we're going to go over it with some black face paint and black eyeshadow. Now contour your cheeks with a nice blush. To give the illusion of teeth, I'm drawing short vertical lines on my lips. To go the extra mile, Add a little bit of purple shadow on the inner part of your lips. Now I've just drawn on a cute lotus on my chin and it looks so adorable. And I'm just going to fill that in with a cute purple and add a little bit orange to have some detail. I've added swirls as a finishing touch to my skeleton mouth. I'm adding blue glitter to really make my eyes pop. For the final touch, I've added a beautiful flower headband. So this is the final product, guys. I really hope you love this look. I had so much fun videotaping it for you. Comment below and let me know how you liked it. Don't forget to like and subscribe.